Hello and what is going on today guys, Tomcat here and welcome to a brand new mod spotlight in Spin Tires Mudrunner. Now, this is the M939, otherwise known as the 5 ton. Now, we don't really get that many of these American military trucks in this game as mods and I'm really happy whenever they pop up and whenever they... Whenever they make their way into the game. And by the way, I will leave a link in the description box below to where you guys can download this truck on the Steam Workshop. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and run through some of the things that we have available on it. Now, there are a couple of different add-ons up there that I really don't know where they came from. And, wow, it looks like you can, like, straight up tow, like, full-on trailers with it if you really want to. And you can do, um, you can use logging attachments. You have, like... So many pages and pages and pages of basically, basically endless amounts of things you could use this truck for. So if you wanted to haul with it, you could do that. If you wanted to log with it, you could do that. You could literally do whatever you wanted. Let's see. Log carriage, like carriage with crane. Lumber mill. Oh my god. Yeah, no, the amount of stuff you can haul with this truck is just genuinely incredible. I mean, there are more compatible attachments for this than I think I've ever seen for just about any other truck. I mean, look at that. Like, we already have a crazy setup right off the bat. Now, we should keep in mind, and it's worth noting, that I have not been here uh, pretty much, well... Actually, have I ever been here? I mean, it's a tiny little map, but I think I've probably been here like maybe once or twice before, and that's a maybe. That's a maybe. So I'm definitely learning this map as I go along, but we've also certainly got the right truck to do it with. Now, the lumber mill, I just want to see how this thing drives when it's fully loaded, and I also want to see if this... Uh, if this trailer setup is too big for the trails we're about to attempt. But I also want to see what this thing does in terms of trail performance while hauling. Because it's a 5 ton. It's made to haul stuff. Oh, it's got like a proper interior too. That's awesome. You can definitely tell that they went to the extra effort to make a working interior. Uh, how did you get there? What the heck are you doing over there, little dude? Like, how did you get there? I just want to rescue it. Like, I feel bad for it. Come on! Ooh, I'm really trying to not get caught on everything. Because this thing really is massive, so getting caught on just about every other little thing on this trail is totally a possibility, by the way. Come on, there we go. I'm honestly surprised we haven't gotten caught on anything yet. Like, it's ridiculous the amount that we... <laughs> the, it's ridiculous the amount of stuff we've been able to drive around without getting caught on. Now, we are getting caught on that tree, but I think that's an easy fix. Oh, you even get the proper tire marks from these tires. That's awesome. I believe these are based on a Michelin, but I could be wrong. Like, uh, based on a Michelin military tire. I want to say they're based on a Michelin military tire, but I, like I said, I could be wrong on that. Let me know in the comment section below. Um, but I'm pretty sure they are Michelin military tires. Here we go. Truck slid downwards just enough for me to catch it with the trailer. I'm going to have to go this way. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, well... I'm going to pull the trailer over that way to get the, like, trailer stakes off of the tree. That's a really crappy situation. There we go. Easy. So I'm going to go around this side, go around on the right, because I feel like it'll be a little bit easier for me to straighten it out. And maybe I'm wrong on that. I am wrong on that. Uh, yeah, that was a bad decision. It takes a while to turn the wheel. I mean, they really want to drive home the point that this thing has really heavy steering. And, I mean, I completely understand why they want to drive that point home. Because I'm sure it would have very heavy steering. Can we even make this fit? I doubt it.
Ah, I don't think she's going anywhere. Oh, yep, there she is. Come on, there we go. There it is. I got to say, we've already made it further than I thought we would. So anything like from this point forward is a fairly like fairly decent amount of success in my book. Because really, I didn't even think we would come close to getting this far with a trailer that long. I mean, look, we're just lifting the back wheels off the ground and the front axle's like, okay, we got this under control, no big deal. God, it's such a, um, it's such a, like, almost, almost a death mission. Oh, there's nowhere to turn around? Oh, you've got to be kidding me, which means I'm turning around first. Yeah, I'm going to turn around first before I even attempt to load up. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. All right. Come on. God, I don't even know if we can actually fit the trailer into the spot that I want to fit it into. Actually, we might be able to. We're just going to turn it around a different way. There we go. There we go. There we go. I know we've hit the little clothesline post, but that's okay. I'm not worried about that. Yeah, I was going to say, I'm not worried about that. What I'm hoping to do is just to be able to, like... Near, near jackknife it all the way around, which I, we pretty much did, surprisingly, and we can still winch that trailer back into place if we want, uh, but it's not close enough to any of the winch points to do that. Sad, sad boy. Oh, I've really done it now. I have really done it now. Here, let's see. There we go. There we go. Keep the trailer in place while we while we drive the opposite direction. Oh my god, I'm terrible at backing a trailer in this game apparently. Haha! -ha! Yes, that'll work. Now we just gotta be very careful. Yep, there it is. There it is. Holy crap. Alright, that's that's what we needed. That's the opportunity we needed right there. Come on, let's go, 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 go. There it is. And now, <clears throat> now to load up. Oh, buddy. This thing is fully loaded now, boys. Now the question is, can we get back? I have no idea. Um, Let's see. Block post is open. Trucks with no lumber are allowed to pass. Okay, that's cool and all, but we have lumber, though. I'm not going to worry about it. I was just trying to, like, look and see where we were headed, and... Oh, boy. I just need to go really slow. Did the trailer come off? Ah! The trailer came off! Oh, no! How did that happen? Oh, no, 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 no! It's going to lose its... Oh, boy. How did the trailer come off? Well, that doesn't make any sense. That legit makes absolutely no sense at all. Okay, because I didn't even... I didn't even twist the truck up in a way that would have been bad. Like, I literally was just driving. That makes absolutely no sense. Maybe I missed something. That was weird, though. 
All right, let's get this trailer hitch off. And let's see. Oh, you know what? We'll put the trailer hitch back on. And to kind of redeem ourselves from that, we're going to deliver another truck. We may not be delivering lumber, but we're going to deliver another truck. And that's going to be... I mean, it won't be exactly what we set out to do, but... Where is it? Container. There it is. All right. It won't be what we originally set out to do, but it'll be something. And I, I, I want to actually feel like I got something done uh, in the test of this truck. So, Put those ramps down, and then we'll put the other orange truck on the back of this trailer. I mean, I'm sure it'll go up just fine. Just fine. Oh man, this thing has like no diff lock, no off, no all wheel drive. I wonder if it'll even be able to drive up on the back of the trailer. It should be able to. I don't see why not. Here, just to make it more interesting, we'll throw an attachment on the back of this guy right here. Oh no. None of that. I was like, no. Oh no. All right, where's my like simple stuff? That works. I was going to say, just like a simple attachment that I don't have to worry too much about. Up you go. There you go. Ah, uh, since we only have one truck, I'm going to put it in the middle of the trailer. And stop. Parking brake on. That's not what I wanted. I was going to say, that is that is not what I wanted. No. Oh, my God. M939. Thank you. You could definitely tell, though, that there's a little bit of weight on the back of the truck now, which is what we wanted. We wanted a good test of it, and that should be what we're going to get now. Off we go. What's nice about this is that the lumber mill shouldn't be all that far away. However, I don't know what sits between us and it, so there could be some really crappy obstacles in between us and the lumber mill, but, but hopefully not. We do have to go through... Oh, no. We do have to go through that mess, which is going to be annoying. If the trailer gets bound up again, I'm going to just... I might, I might just call it, or I might go through here. Because I guarantee you that angle's too sharp. We're not going to be able to make it at that angle. So we're going to have to go this way, unfortunately. But the thing is, we can't make that turn either. Oh, we can't make the turn. We can't take the... You know what? We're going to go this way. We're going to go straight. And I'm going to say, screw it. And if we make it, we make it. And if we don't, then that's that. We're going to have to go stupid wide. Like, stupid wide. Are you kidding me, dude? Jeez, it, it wants to. That's the thing. She wants to go. Come on, baby. Come on. No, there's no way. There's absolutely no way that that is happening. Nope. Not on a map this tight, but on a bigger map with more space, yes, this would be an absolute beast. It would be an animal. It would be a blast. But on a map this small, it's a little too big for it. So if you want to check this mod out, there'll be a link in the description box below. There'll, all, there'll also be links down there to where you can check out my stream on Mixer and also to where you can check out my channel on Discord or my server, sorry, on Discord. But again, hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Talk to you all later.